Hello! Welcome to another First Contact Polymer how-to video. While bird watching at the Mississippi River, I noticed my monocular was dirty, and I wasn't sure how to clean it without scratching or smudging it even worse. Thankfully, I have a kit from First Contact Polymer, and I'm going to use it today to clean my monocular lens. The red First Contact regular kit includes a mesh and floss sample, one 15 milliliter bottle with an applicator brush, two 30 milliliter bottles, 25 peel tabs for removing the polymer, and one pipette for a more precise application. Taking the pipette, I pick up a little bit of polymer from the 15 milliliter bottle. Using a business card or any type of strong paper scrap, I'm holding it underneath the pipette to catch any accidental drips, and I'm gently applying it to the eyepiece of my monocular. Using the applicator brush, I'm pulling the polymer around the eyepiece, making sure I don't get too close to the edge, because the polymer could seep through the retaining ring of the eyepiece. You could apply an O-ring for a safer application, but if you're careful, it isn't necessary. After letting it dry for about 10 minutes, I'm going to use a piece of the sample floss and bend it at a 90 degree angle. Then I'm going to lay it on the mostly dried polymer and sandwich it down with another thin layer of polymer. After letting that dry for about a half hour, it's ready to peel off. Then I'm going to move on to the larger lens. I'm repeating the same step as before using the pipette to apply a small amount of polymer to the middle of the lens. I'm using the surface tension to gently glide the brush across the polymer, preventing the brush from contacting the lens. This prevents the brush from scratching the sensitive optic. After it's mostly dry, I'm going to bend a piece of the sample mesh, just like I did with the floss, at a 90 degree angle and place it on top of the polymer. Then I'm going to sandwich it down with another thin layer of polymer. I'm going to let this dry for about a half hour and then it's ready to peel off. After removing the polymer, it's like a brand new monocular there isn't any dust or any residue. It gives me a way better success at identifying native birds. Thank you so much for watching this video. 